All that and the hot topics you want to hear as The View celebrates Season 8. is chilling in the new movie, September Dawn. It is supposedly the true story of a Mormon bishop who calls on his flock to murder in the name of the Lord. Take a look. We, we have been honored above all other men to be the chosen instruments of death in carrying out this merciful deed. We have a duty to perform. It is a duty we owe to God and to our church. The orders of those in authority are that all the immigrants must die. Ooh, please welcome back John Voigt. Yes, but woo, this movie. So, as, as I understand it, because I have you know, it's so nice for me to be here with oh, all no. of you beautiful <laughs> women. It's everybody. You know, it's a health thing. If you need, if if someone needs to get a little, you know, bit of a, a health shot, come on with us. The, the guys should come on and be on the view and <laughs> surround themselves with femininity. <laughs> <laughs> so let's talk about this movie because yeah, yeah. just in the little bit we saw, I mean, this yeah, is very mm -hmm. strong stuff. It's yeah, based on the story of the 1857 called Mountain Murder Massacre, Mountain Meadows, Meadows Massacre mm -hmm. in Utah. And this a movie says that Mormons slaughtered 120 defenseless California settlers mm -hmm. from Arkansas. Mm -hmm. Are you concerned that this is going to upset a lot of Mormons? Well, it's a tough film. It's a very strong film, very powerful. Has Mitt Romney seen this and, film? Uh, I, I don't know. Uh, of course, it was made before so Mitt was in the, in the race and all of that. But uh, the, in, interestingly enough, the Mormons, perhaps uh, based on a response to this, to this film we've just made, uh, have a, an official statement that's on their website now that uh, agrees to all of the incidences. Hmm right up uh, just short of the, of the role of Brigham Young. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So it's, uh, uh, you know, it's... So the a, bad Mormons and the good Mormons. Well, Brigham Young there's a, there's a Brigham well, was, was the, the, the founder or the leader, and it does... Yeah. Is he involved in this? He's his in character, the, he, so his it's... His character is in the is film played by yeah. Terrence Stamp, and yeah. brilliantly played oh. by Terrence oh, yeah. Stamp. I'm Did you have sure. any apprehension in terms of playing such a, I mean, it was a despicable character, you know, in terms of portrayal? No, he I, I love that. You do, you do. That. You know, I, it's, right you know you, you, the story when it was given to me was a, I couldn't stop reading it, and then I had to check the authenticity. That's what really was important to me, and then uh, seeing that this was a, an accurate portrait so far as I could see. I thought, uh, well, I can play this part, and I'm going to go ahead and do it. Mm. Mm. This massacre yeah. took place on September 11th, 1857, right. and you say that there are incredible parallels with September 11th we all um, endured. Here yes. in New York City and yeah. Isn't the US. It, yeah, it's ironic. 150 years ago, this September 11th, this massacre took, took place. Uh -huh. And uh, it's, a, it's an act of religious fanaticism. And, uh, and one of the other reasons why I did the film, of course, is because it has such relevance to what we're seeing today, what mm. we're faced, mm. what we're faced with. And, uh, it, uh, describe that more. What do you mean? Well, you know, it, this is the story of how a group of religious fanatics uses, uh, ra uses religion to mm -hmm. rationalize murder. Yeah, it's mm -hmm. not the first now, time. Now we're in facing this the exactly what we're facing today. Right. It's radicalism. And uh, you know, when we look at people, when we look at uh, the people today, like they just the Taliban just shot a, a group of young girls going to school yes. because they didn't want, because in their religion they don't allow children, uh, uh, girls to get education. Mm -hmm. When they, when you see on television, you say you can't uh, understand why a, a young, how a young boy could be programmed a 12-year-old boy to saw off the head of an innocent, uh, you know, victim. Mm -hmm. And, you know, you see all these things that are happening today. You, you say, I can't believe that this is going on. How can this be? But then you see animated, uh, uh, you know, the cartoons, the cartoons that they cartoons directed right. at children who were t teaching the children f to become suicide bombers. This is exactly what's going on. So, so, so this, this, this movie has this relevance. I, I want to move on to... Uh, 
I hope, happier subjects, because you've come yeah. on with us and you are a friend of the show, <coughs> and we, you, we've talked before about yeah. your daughter, Angelina Jolie. Uh -huh. Um, you knew we had well, to bring it up, don't you? Yeah. So, I mean, you've had, you've had your differences, and she is enormously popular. Mm -hmm. uh, I, I, are you in touch? Are you getting closer? Well, there's been talk about that, but we haven't uh, been in touch yet. But I certainly send her all my love, always, and, mm -hmm. and uh, you know, I always wish the best for her and the kids. And the, Do you see the Brad kids ever? Have you uh, seen no, any I have, not, I have yeah. not seen them. She's become, you know, a worldwide fascination. Mm -hmm. Uh, that must that make that you happen? feel in many ways very proud, but I do, what, what do you think it is that has made everybody respond to your daughter? Well, you know, every father thinks that their daughter is the most fascinating and most beautiful person <laughs> in the world. Yeah, but yours is. And... <laughs> That's it. Yours you know, really is. is. I was going to take I was preparing to say that, but you see, being on with Joy, she's just... Sorry. I'm sorry. No, it's okay. It's baby, all right, baby. The yeah. baby that they have, little... Uh, what's the baby's name? The, uh, that they have Brad and Angelina. Yeah. The, the, the child that they... Uh, Biologically. Looks like you and has the little lips like you and Angelina. Oh. It, it's a, a beautiful little baby. Well, yeah. it is a beautiful baby. Have you met Brad? Mm -hmm. I know Brad, but yeah. I haven't seen him yeah, recently, though. Yeah. No. Well, you know, you're in a very difficult role, and you've, you have been very honest, and it can't be easy. And, you know, I thank you for doing that, because we have to ask one more question. That can, we can have any more Personal time here? Because I've got a couple of things. i just got well, one thing to do. All right, go ahead. Two things. Let me do it quickly. I'm going to talk like Elizabeth. You know the way Elizabeth talks so quickly? I'm going to do that. I'm going to do Elizabeth. It's effective. I'm in a movie called Bratz. My goddaughter is in it. I've taken her on the red carpet many, many times. Is that her right there? No, that's that's the girl who plays my my daughter in the film. But But my goddaughter is Skylar Shea, and now she's in this movie. She's one of the Bratz. The Bratz movie for parents and grandparents is a terrific yes. movie with lots of wonderful messages for kids. Guess what? Okay. Elizabeth Big surprise. surprise. Say and, that yes. for you. and faster. Yeah. I'm a fan of that. I love was the I slow, that I'm slowing there. down? You're a little, little no. slow. No. You'll be quick like me one day, John. No, but there was one gossip question I had to ask you. So I, I have something else to say. Oh, okay. I, I talked to, you see what this is? Yeah. Support of the troops. I support the troops, yes. and, I, and I, I recommend that everybody go and go to these hospitals where the kids are coming back, and, and when you see a, a, a kid at the airport, go embrace him and thank him. Great. All we of this stuff. Yeah. 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 You have to do this real fast. No, no, I, just, no. I just read that, that John Voight was dating Diana Ross. I thought that was what a you fabulous combo. What was the date of that newspaper? It's okay. It's about a so year and a half old. I mean, yes or no? He did. Oh, it was true. It was on this show I talked about it. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> it was three years ago. Please. I need help. <laughs> September dawn hits theaters August 24th. Thank you so much, oh, John.